morning, everybody. Good morning. How's everyone doing? Good, good. Uh, my name is Richard Fall. I'm the owner of Bliss Drive. Uh, April 1st would be my six years out of corporate uh, doing internet marketing full time. Uh, I've been running Bliss Drive for over two and a half years now, and I'd like to show you some of the results that we've uh, accomplished and what it means to a, a client that we were served. Um, first off, we have a lot of attorneys in here. Now, I want to ask you guys a question. How do you know an attorney is any good? How do you know? Any, yeah? If they're a certified specialist. Uh, <laughs> sir, okay. <laughs> that's good, that's good. But, but you know, what, what, do you, what does that mean? What is that, how does that help you, right? At the end of the day, it's the record. It's what, you know, what their case wins are. It's their accomplishments, right? Um, and I want to show you, you know, same goes with the SEO company. How do you know if the SEO company is any good, right? Uh, you know, their, their point is to get rankings. And if they're not ranked, how do you know if they're going to rank you, right? So I want to just show you um, some of our, our accomplishments in terms of, you know, getting rankings, right? So if you search... You can go home and do this yourself. Um, Orange County SEO, okay, one of the pretty competitive keyword. Um, a lot of Orange County SEO companies want to rank for this keyword. And, you know, the yellow part is the advertising, and this number one is right here, Bliss Drive, okay? Now, I'm not saying, you know, watching this right now or listening to this right now, it's going to stay like that because Google did, does dance. But we've been there for a couple of months now, and, you know, it's a, it's a, it's a good accomplishment for us. Um, if you go into or a Los Angeles SEO company, um, you'll find Bliss Drive is number one, right? Um, you know, we're kind of dancing around with uh, Los Angeles SEO with another guy. I'm number two right now, so I can't really show. But, you know, last, last week I was number one. I couldn't show it for this presentation. That's too bad. That's okay. That's okay. So um, what does being number one mean to a business, to my business, right? Uh, to me, it means when I woke up this morning, well, actually, I, when I was working on my presentation last night, um, two leads came in, two very strong leads, and this morning, another lead came in. So waking up in the morning, you get three strong leads in your email box. What business were like that in their, in their business, right? Uh, yeah, a lot of businesses were like that. Um, you know, so if, if you get a call from, like, an SEO company, Hey, that's, there's something wrong with that, okay? It's like kind of like a car salesman who rides a bike to work, right? And then, like, what, what, why are you calling me? Like, you're in the SEO business, right? So you want to ask him, hey, where are you ranked? Uh, you know, what, what, kind, what, what website do you have and where are you ranked at? You know, and then they're like, oh, uh, well, and they'll give you, oh, we're too busy helping clients, so we don't have time to rank ourselves, right? And that's kind of like saying, like an accountant saying, oh, I'm too busy helping other people file taxes. I forgot to do mine, right? Why do you want to trust someone like that? You, know, you got to think about that when they, when they want to, you know, call you up and try to ask you for business. You want to make sure that, you know, any, any marketing company, that, hey, what kind of marketing have you done for yourself and how can you prove it, right? If they, they may not be able to share their clients' results, but they can certainly share their own, okay? So that's one of the uh, advantages of having a, a good ranking. You know, you have a very strong sales, salesperson working for you 24-7. Um, they don't call in sick. They don't ask for raises. They just work for you all the time, right? And how you position your website inside really does the pre-selling for you, right? When they call me, they already know that, hey, this guy's pretty much, you know, this guy's proven himself. He's established and they're ready to just listen to you and, um, you know, see if they can work with you, right? So enough about me. Let's talk about how I can help clients, right? Um, one, by, you know, one of my favorite clients, and everyone knows here, is uh, HR Advisors, right? Um, we started working last year in May. Um, Ed was, uh, you know, in the beginning, he was a little hesitant with SEO and internet marketing in general because, um, you know, years previous, he spent a lot of money on pay-per-click, and it just fumbled pretty much, you know. It, there was a lot of excitement, a lot of money went in, but there was not a lot of results. So after that, you know, he, uh, Ed was pretty hesitant on going into SEO, so I had to do a lot of talking with Ed about, hey, let's, you know, start on a limited engagement and just see, because I knew, I knew it was going to, you know, it was going to do really well on a national level um, for these kind of, for this industry, right? So we started in May, and today, I mean, it's been about eight months or so, uh, even maybe a little longer.
But Ed's website, HR Advisors, is ranked number one for uh, recruiting services, okay? Uh, right here, this is the paid version. This is number one, recruiting services. Um, recruitment service, number one right here. Um, HR consulting firms, and of course, as favorite HR compliance audit. Now, the number one here is a slice share. It's, it's a presentation form. It's not a real company. Um, and then the number two is HR advisors right here, right? So as you can see, I mean, if you're in as business, you want to kind of be ranked number one. It's kind of a good thing to be ranked one, number one for uh, eight, you know, recruiting services. I'm not going to tell you what the volume is. You can, uh, but there's, there's a good amount of volume, right? So what does all this mean for as business? Okay. In terms of traffic, um, this is what it means right here. Okay. Uh, this chart starts at 2009, and basically, you know, as business, I can kind of go through it slowly. You can see that um, his traffic is, you know, stable. It's about 20, 30 um, on the weekdays, and then weekends it drops off. And it's been like that for many, many years, right, 2009 to 2011. Now, let's look at the time when we started engaging on uh, as website, HR advisors. Um, this is around May right here, okay? Um, it's, you know, about the same. And, and like I tell everyone, results for SEO takes at least three months to see initial results, right? Initial, meaning, you know, you may not even get a good ROI, but you'll see like, okay, it's, it's kind of working, right? So, you know, this is May right here. About nothing really seems to change. We're working on it, building links, and uh, working on the content of the site. Um, and then you'll see a little jump right here uh, about in August, right? That's about the three months mark. You see a little trinkle. Okay, we got 40, uh, 40 some visitors. It's about a little higher. And then month, another three months down the road, around November, you get another peak, right? He's getting about 70 visitors, um, you know, per day and things like that. And then Christmas comes around, New Year's, seasonal drop off uh, at that rate. And then we pick it up back up. Right there, you know. Sometimes you get 90, 95 visitors. Um, you know, you can talk to Ed, and he can tell you what kind of clients and what kind of calls he's getting. You know, I don't want to share that information, um, but you can see from the. I asked Ed for approval to share this analytics data, but you can see how SEO works in that. Um, you know, three months is <laughs> an initial, and then you get a hit, and then it's going to keep going. It's going to keep going. Let me show you some numbers. Right, this is just graphs. Okay. Um, Okay, so this is April. See this April right here, April 2012. Okay, his visitor traffic was about 730 right here. Okay, now what does that mean? Um, this month alone, his website traffic is is March 1st, 2013 to 27th. Okay, the month is not even over yet. Uh, his visitor traffic is about 1680. Right, so no more than double than what he started with. And we're not even, we're not done yet. We're not finished. It's a campaign. It's a marathon. It's going to keep going, right? So that's, that's what that means for Ed's business. You know, you hear Ed talking about Empire State Building calling him. I'm sure there's other, con other people calling and contacting him. Um, you know, we see the forums, so we know there's a lot of activity going on in his website. So that's what that means to a business once SEO is done correctly for them and they're ranked uh, well-placed. In, in keywords that matters, right? So, in conclusion, I do have a conclusion on this. You know, I I love to help. This is a national national company. Um, I love to help small businesses as well. And I have a lot of clients in here that I've helped, and they are number one uh, for their own industries and keywords. And um, my my focus here is get to get to more national clients um, because with national clients. Uh, you can make a real big impact really quick in terms of getting their rankings up for the, a few key words, and then volume will come through, right? Uh, we're very, you know, don't get me wrong. There's a lot of local business here, and we're very good at supporting them. We have the Google Maps down. We have the reviews. We have everything down for local business. Um, but national, um, you know, if you guys hear anything about a national company, even, even global at this point, because we're looking at, different languages and different Google at different countries and servers and all this. Right, I'm, I'm, I'm always trying to grow uh, in terms of my experience and my knowledge. So this is kind of my next level uh, in terms of 
uh, the ability to rank things and just not even ranking, not even SEO, but uh, internet marketing overall because it's changing. And um, you know, I appreciate it if you uh, if you know any companies that need SEO and you need solid proof, just point. Hey, Google Orange County SEO, Google Los Angeles SEO. I think it'd be easy enough to to refer me. Thank you.